Hello guys, so how to make the top bunk bed in Minecraft. Now, uh, those who are coming by, chances are you're looking for the actual Minecraft beds, how to use it, or some of you just want the aesthetic looking where you just use wool. So in order to please both of you, we're gonna do both. Okay, let's do this. And I just saved a screenshot. That's kind of weird. Well, let's see here. We need to get the beds. Let's do the short and easy one first. And really this is so easy. You just need two beds. Then I think acacia doors look the best, but you can use any door. Any type of door. And I can use ladders. So. And the second bed you saw me place, if I hold down left shift and then place it, that's how it goes up. Uh, set. It's almost daytime. Nighttime, I mean. Okay. Then what you do is you come up to your bed, turn around, and hop, and boom. Place a door like that. Come over here and do the same thing. And that gives you the two corners. Then hold down left shift and... Oh, it doesn't work anymore. Well, you don't have to do ladders. The thing is, you don't have to get up on a bed like that. But if we want, we can just go put some blocks behind us and do a ladder that way. So you see you have the bottom bunk and the top bunk. And you can use the ladder to get the top one if you want. But if you're sleeping, you know, you don't have to jump up into it. Just right click on it. So that's using the regular beds. Um, but now if we want to do it, if we use wool, so it, you know you can't sleep in it, but it does look fancy. Let's go ahead and we'll need wool. Whoops. We also will need carpet. Then we need some kind of wood. We can use any type. Let's let's use spruce. And I like spruce logs as well. Okay. Oops. I'm just gonna place two white wool down there, and two more right here. This is where the carpet comes in. Boom, boom. Okay. Then one, two, three, four. In order to walk underneath, we're gonna make sure we have at least two headspace. So that means we can put the two wool right there. Boom, 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 boom. And again, the carpet. The carpet is used for the pillows. See that? I think it look makes it look better, like it has pillows. Then we can put the supports on each side. I don't think I'll do all the way up like that. Then we'll do more slabs. Oops. Now the back, I like to do like this. I'll show you why. Okay, so we got those slabs. At the top, I'm going to want some stairs as well. Again, this is just for aesthetics. You can put those stairs on the outsides too, however you want. You can design it however you want. Let's make that one like that because I think that looks cool. Okay. Now the back, we want to do stairs like this. Makes it look like a little shelf area you can put something in. And we'll do that for the top as well. Whoops. Okay. Yeah. Well, I like to do bookshelves. I've always liked bookshelves for the tops. Yeah, I think that looks kind of cool. Okay. And then, I want to make sure you can get up to the top bunk. So you can come here, and here's your little bed. And you can come up here. To this bed. And you could stop there, but I mean, you can keep going to make it look even better or cooler. I mean, you can put slabs down like this, so, you know, if it's like the kids that sleep up here, they have the roll bars there so they don't fall off. You can even do that for the bottom, like this. That makes it so you have to get into the bed from the back end right here. And you can even go like that. Slabs down there, so it's a completed shelf area. Yeah, yeah. yeah kind of, kind of fun. Should we get weird and keep going, keep adding more stuff? 
Okay, this is, just became a very weird bunk bed. I don't think any one of you will do this, but then again, maybe you will. Putting those fences there. Just making it really epic. Maybe we even need a painting. Oh ho ho! Painting. Not bad, not bad. Yeah. This is basically called greebling. That's where you just put stuff there just to add definition and depth to make something look more epic. Let's even do it. Yeah, let's even do it for up here too. Yeah, see? Boy, that's quite the bunk bed, isn't it? It just gets weirder and weirder. But it's kind of fun. Come here and sleep in your lovely bunk bed. Well, I think that's all for this little tutorial, but at least you saw how to do the bunk bed, and most especially, how to do the top bunk. It's kind of fun. And you, you can still change it up too, and make it look cooler. In fact, what I'd probably do is put a stair there instead. But then you can't see the bookshelf, so whatever. Okay, well, that's it guys, so bye. <laughs>